NHL player has defied the NHL's ban on pride tape less than two weeks after it went into effect. Arizona's Travis Dermott put rainbow colored tape on a stick Saturday and as CTV's Kyle Moore shows us a lot of locals applaud his stance. A celebration of Canada's game was on full display during an NHL preseason game in Sydney recently. But the league's position on banning the use of pride tape is having a ripple effect at the grassroots level. They want the NHL and its fan base to look and feel like the communities that the club teams play in. And uh, so banning something like pride tape is almost flies right in the face of that ambition. Travis Dermott of the Arizona Coyotes became the first NHL player since the ban to use pride tape on his stick during a game on Saturday night. The move comes less than two weeks after the league outlined what can and cannot be done during themed celebrations this year. I think it's a tremendous uh, show of uh, allyship. Travis has been using the tape for a long time and is one of the few players who uses it quite regularly. Christopher Wells is the co-founder of Pride Tape and says sales have taken off since the ban has been announced. It's really important that uh, the NHL listens to its players. They want uh, the freedom to be able to express themselves and the causes that they hold near and dear to uh, their heart. And, and really, uh, I think we've just seen the first of many players that will be using pride tape. Wells says he wants the league to reverse its decision and allow players to use the tape. And there are many who feel the same way. Taking that away or banning it, um, is going to send a very clear message to a fairly sizable chunk of the community, and particularly um, uh, children and youth. Veronica Merrifield is the founder of the Cape Breton Transgender Network and speaks regularly about the importance of inclusion. She says theme nights, especially Pride nights, are important. They produce um, an awareness that. Um, those in the Pride community need that support. So far, the NHL has not commented publicly on Dermot defying the ban. Kyle Moore, CTV News, Sydney.